of the defense here back to Mayo. LJ gets it back. He's got Chris Kuhn on him. Eye to eye. LJ. Whoa! Oh, how oh, did oh. he make that shot? That is a mind-blowing sequence. Take me through it, Jeff. I mean, when you want to take charge, you take charge like this, taking Chris Kuhn to the hoop, Obasa challenging, and like you mentioned, how did he get this shot off and make it? And then time, FEU Ateneo all over again. Paguno on Panungay, Torres on Brown. Kuhn comes out of a double elevator screen. Amos will shoot the three and gets it to go. In, out, and in again. How many highlight plays have we seen from both teams here today, Jeff? And how many times have we said Mason Amos with a huge three-point shot was initially drawn for Kuhn, makes the right decision, Amos popping out, and he knows he's going to take that. He ain't afraid to make that basket, and he did. His third triple of the game, 11 points, and that is a point nine. And the main question that is a Filipinas live? <laughs> LJ! LJ! Live. Who will have late game heroics? Mason Amos or MJ Gonzalez? Ano ba to? Anong script na script yung dating nito? <laughs> Let's look at that play again and see from your vantage point, Jed. We, we, we all see this now. Uh, Gonzalez releases the ball. Turnover. 19 points for LJ. Three triples. And the game winner at the horn. Hey. To the delight.